Hello, welcome to the video for sixth grade for uh, Friday, April the 10th. This is going to cover the homework uh, from working with the area of trapezoids. So uh, let's go ahead and take a look at our problems. Um, to start with, I have written everything in so far, so this should be a shorter video um, and I can just spend more of my time explaining than trying to scribble in. So uh, to start with, we have 6.5 and 5.5 as our two bases. We add those together to get 12. And then we end up multiplying that times uh, 0.5. That is going to give us, that should have been a, uh, actually, I think it ended up over here, uh, times 0.5 gives us 6. Our height is worth 5. So we are going to have 6 times 5 equals 30 square feet. Number four, our bases are going to be two and a half inches or 2.5 uh, plus five inches. That's going to give us a total of 7.5 inches for our combined bases. We multiply that by five and we would get, or sorry, by 0 0.5, five tenths, and we would get uh, 3.75. That we will multiply by our height, which is going to be 10 inches. And that's as simple as moving a decimal point over, and that would give us 37.5. Uh, number four on the front, we want to solve for the height. So we are going to start with, I'm going to try to scoot this over so it's not blocked on the screen. We have 43.5 square centimeters for our area. So that is going to be equal to one half of both of our bases added together times the height. So I'm going to add both of these together, get 14.5. Then I am going to um, multiply by one half. That would give us 7.25 times our height. We need to make the height by itself. So we're going to divide both sides by 7.25. When we do that, um, I've written out the problem here. You are going to move our decimal point over two spots, which means we are going to move past the end of our starting number, we need to write a zero in uh, at the end, put our decimal point up top, and that will give us an answer of six. I forgot to type that one in. So that's gonna be six for our answer. So let's go ahead and take a look at our problems on the right-hand side. So I'm dragging everything around on accident. There we go. Well, there we go. Let me try dragging from this side. There we go. Sorry about that. Um, so number one, uh, the joys of using technology and having things be able to slide around on you. Um, so we are building a bench with a seat in the shape of a trapezoid. One base is five feet, the other base is four feet. That is going to give us a total of nine feet we can multiply that by one half to get 4.5. Perpendicular distance is a fancy way of saying our height uh, for this. So our height is going to be 2.5. So we're gonna take our nine feet, multiply it by one half to get 4.5, multiply that by 2.5, and we should get 11.25 square feet. And then number two, we are again solving for the area. So this part looks a little bit messy because I'm repurposing uh, the same space uh, to do two different things. So what I did was I started with writing 504, which is our area, is equal to one half of 30 plus 18 for our two bases times the height. So our total for that would be 48. Half of that would be 24. 24 times our height, so we are going to divide both sides by 24. When we do that, I can do that part up here um, to save space. So that's what I did. I took my original number and wrote the division problem in there. That gives us 21 inches for our height. So I hope that helps you uh, for understanding the answers uh, to those particular problems. Um, if you are watching uh, this on Friday morning, I have a lesson video and another homework video coming. Um, on Friday. Uh, the lesson video will be at 8 a.m. and the homework video will be at 6 p.m. So I will see you in the next couple videos.
Have a good day.